Hey guys, it's Link's Rage here, and today I'm going to be doing a TOTS prediction video, so a team in season predictions. Um, if there's a player that you wanted me to include in this, leave it down in the comment section, and I'll try and do it better for next time, for like if I'm doing another one. Um, but starting off, in goal, we are going with Hugo Lloris, which has had a great season for Tottenham. He had a great season altogether in football. He's been a top-notch keeper. I don't know. I don't know who I would, who else I would put in this position. I could have put like the Schmeichel, but really, Lloris deserves it. I think. Um, so yeah, he's been a really good keeper. Now we move on to right back. Unfortunately, Seamus Coleman is, is injured now, but the season. When he was not, when he wasn't injured, he was playing so well. He's playing so well right back. I don't know if Everton thought that themselves, but I think he played really good. And a centre back from Chelsea, which isn't David Luiz. I think Cahill doesn't get enough credit, uh, so I've put him in there because I just don't think he gets enough credit for Chelsea. And Alderweireld, another Tottenham player, but he's played so good. I don't know how I wouldn't include him in this. James Milner has played an amazing season for Liverpool. A great season altogether at left back. He's played so well. I don't know where Liverpool would be without him. And the next player, Manny, I don't know where they would be without him either because he's been playing so well for them. He's done he's had so many involvements with goals and stuff. I don't know where Liverpool would be without Manny right now. I think Manny is really keeping them up in the seasons. Now we move on to centre mids, which you can't forget, can't you? Player of the year. You want player of the year. I mean, that's amazing. Um, the passes, the intercepts, the, everything he's been doing this season has been great. Like, And then Dele Alli as well, the young player of the year. Another Tottenham player, obviously, but he's played so good this season. Amazing passing abilities, amazing shooting abilities. Some of the goals that I've seen from him this season have been unbelievable, ridiculous. And another Tottenham player, which is Huming Son, he has played so well um, for Tottenham. He's just played so well this season. Um, Tottenham really appreciate him, I think. Um, and he's got five star weak foot in this game as well, so you don't like that's something you want in your team. Um, now we move on to the strike force. The strike force is amazing. Like anybody would want the strike force, even in real football or in FIFA, obviously. But the first one is Zlatan Ibrahimovic, which obviously plays for Man United. He's played so well this season because they did get him for free and he's just proved himself as well. He has injured the now, um, but he's played in every major league there is to play in. He's played in the Serie A, the Ligue 1, the BPL, the BBVA. He's played in every major league. He is one of the best football players, if not the best football player in the world. Because, yeah, you can say Messi and you can say Ronaldo, but... Who else has done what Ibra's done? He's played in every major league in the world of football. Like, who else has done that in football? The other striker is Roman Lukaku, the Belgian Everton striker himself. He's played so well. The goals he's been getting is amazing. The goal scoring ability that he has is just, like, that's godly. The, f the stamina that he has is amazing as well. So that is the full team. I've put Pep Guardiola in there because just to get to 100 chemistry basically, just because I wanted this to look better even though it's a concept squad. But anyway, if you guys did enjoy this video, leave a like, put it down in the comments if I've missed anybody or what you would like to see in the next video. If you do like videos like these and vlogs, hit subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.